as what should the qualities of a Muslim leader be is the best exemplary Muslim leader in the world is our beloved Prophet Muhammad That is the reason Michael H. Hart, he places him number one in the list of 100 most influential human beings in the history of humankind. Imagine he being a non-Muslim places Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam as number one and he says that Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him was not only successful as a religious leader, he was even successful as a social and a political leader. Because of that he placed him number one. That he was not only a successful religious leader, he was also a successful social and a political leader. So the best example of a political leader in the world today we have is Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him. After that, we have the example of the Khulfa Rashidin, Hazrat Abu Bakr, Hazrat Umar, Hazrat Usman, Hazrat Ali. They are best examples for us after the Prophet. And that's the reason Michael H. Hart, he places you know, Umar al-Khattab, may Allah be with him, as number 51. Because he was a very successful leader. So if today, I'm unfortunately, I don't know of any Muslim leader who is anywhere close to the quality of leadership of Prophet Muhammad not even 